Howdy y'all and welcome back to another video. Today I wanted to talk about how you can take those video clips that you have that have quiet audio and you can bring those audio levels back up to a normal level in 30 seconds or less. All right, so here we are in Premiere Pro with my short clip from the video that I published last week. And I'm looking at the audio track. And as you can see at the beginning of the clip, everything looks fine, but by the end of the clip, you can see my audio levels have gone down quite a bit. So to fix this, I'm going to be using the Dynamics effect. It's a drag and drop effect. It's really nice, really easy. We'll do it quickly, but before, I can actually apply the effect correctly, I do need to find the quietest peaking level. So what I'm gonna do is play the clip through, and by the end of the clip, I'm gonna be looking at the audio meter over here on the right, and I'm gonna see what the quietest peaks are, right? So whatever the quietest noise is here at the end. So let's see where it's at. Right now I'm gonna go ahead and share my top five most memorable and positive experiences from 2020. All right, so right there at the end, right around when I say from 2020, I could see it's peaking right around the negative 21 decibel level. Okay, good. So that's, we, we know where we're starting at. Let's go ahead, come up here to the effects or wherever you have it, and you can simply start typing in dynamics. It'll come up pretty quickly. And then I'm just gonna drag it down onto my audio clip. Then I'm gonna come over to effect controls. You're then gonna wanna scroll down until you find the dynamics tab down here. Click on edit, and it brings up this whole dialog box. Now we're only gonna be worrying about a couple things here. The first one is the compressor and you're gonna to come to the threshold, and at the threshold, you're changing this number to whatever that lowest volume was that you saw. So in my case, it was negative 21. If your lowest volume was negative 18, or negative 12, or whatever it might have been, that's what you're gonna to wanna to put in the threshold option. Then you're gonna come down to the makeup. Now this is where things get a little bit tricky, but basically you're gonna take your threshold number. So for my case, it would be negative 21. And I'm going to add six to it, which would give me a number of negative 15. But you don't wanna put negative numbers in the makeup. So just change whatever negative number you have to a positive. So in this case, it'd be 15. Now you're gonna to wanna to come to your limiter and change this to at least negative three. If you wanna change it to anything less than negative three, like negative six or negative nine for whatever your purposes are, then go ahead and do that. But basically the limiter is going to make sure that nothing ends up peaking. None of your audio levels peak and get that crackling, annoying sound that no one wants to hear. Okay, so now have that done. And as we watch it play through again, you're gonna notice that the beginning sounds great, but also at the end, it's going to sound almost just as loud and easy to hear. Right now I'm gonna go ahead and share my top five most memorable and positive experiences from 2020. And how awesome is that? It's a great way, a fast way to get your audio levels equal and even and sounding good just with the simple drag and drop method. If you like this video, please leave a like, leave a comment if this video was helpful. Check out the rest of my content on my channel and if it's something that you're into, go ahead and subscribe and turn on the notification bell so you get notified every time I put out new videos. <laughs> and until the next one, see ya.